Hey there guys, welcome back to another Gaming with Tai. Boku no namae wa Daichi desu. Uh, we're gonna continue playing a little more Animal Crossing. Not, not Persona 5 Scramble, I don't actually have that game yet, that's the demo. So let's kick back into the game and, uh, have some fun. If only there was a better way to actually prepare for this, like beforehand. I just have to... I have to do it like this so um for those who are still here actually see that thing on the bottom ignore it let me just get rid of that i don't need to worry about that just yet if you're here enjoy the stream just have fun uh for those who are watching this probably in what is it called vod yeah for those who are watching this in VOD, I apologize for having this come out late. Also, uh, I'll explain that later. Um, I planned on streaming yesterday and the day before, but I just wasn't feeling up to it. Technically, I still am not feeling up to it as much. Um, kind of going through stuff where it's just too much stress on my life and I just want to sleep all day sort of thing. So, um... I apologize about that. Let's get uh, into the game. Good morning, everyone. Right on. Right now on Cinnabar, it's 11.15 a.m. on Monday, May 18th, 2020. I have an exciting announcement to share on behalf of our island's esteemed museum director, Blathers. In honor of International Museum Day, the museum will now hold a stamp rally from May 18th to May 31st. Oh, doesn't it sound like fun? I hope like I hope everyone heads over to the museum and joins in the rally. Now for additional announcements. Tomorrow, Cinnabar bids a fond farewell to our dear friend Limber. It's hard to say goodbye, but we wish him luck on his next big adventure. Be sure to stop by for at least one last chat before he leaves. Maybe bring some tissues. That's all for today. Have a fun day out there. Yeah, that... I'll explain later. Oh, looks like I got something in the mail. I got another song. I'll put those away. Oh yeah. I should probably look at my bells before I do that. KK rack time. So, a lot has changed on this island. Let me pick that up. Someone's lost item! Hey Neko, how's it going? Um, it's okay if you just stock in here. Thank you for stopping by. It's better than a... It's really appreciative. So, um, yeah, sorry about that, guys. Really not feeling that good today. Um, so what changed on this island? From last, uh, there's new villagers. One of them is actually leaving this morning. Um, I'll get all to those later. Got some more decorations. Got myself a little snack machine. I got myself a little drink machine. A little silly stuff. Um... Got new villagers, one of them, which this one's leaving, Limburg. He is a mouse villager, and if any of you guys want him, um, well, I mean, he's leaving today, so if any of you guys want him, you can have him. He's a drunk rat, and I don't really like him. And that's why he's leaving. Hey, you want to give me a hand with packing and moving? <laughs> I'm just teasing. Thanks for being a stand-up neighbor while I was here, kiddo. The comedic irony inside that statement is huge. You know I'll be on some other island far away. I'll think of you from time to time. Count on it. Move out faster. I love your wallpaper though. He is he. I am so glad he's getting out of my village. The reason why he's getting out of my village is he looks like a drunkard rat. Like, he looks like an alcoholic rat. The next villager on this island is this one, who I 
of um, not wanting to interact with them, I will not tell you about them. Or I will not go into their house. I'll actually just tell you what they are. Now, in order for me to remember their name, I'm going here. This is Violet. She is a purple gorilla, and that's the only thing I could say that is relatively good about her. She has a sense of style, I guess. But it's kind of like that sense of style you get from, like, stereotypical, like, rich people sort of thing. Where it's like, oh, pearl necklace, velvet, all that stuff. I'm like, I don't like how she looks. I don't like her personality. I don't really want her on my island. I got her, Violet, and uh, Limburg because I was trying to get Rosie. Now, um, Rosie is also another new villager, which I uh, I will show you. She is an absolute pleasure to have on this island. She is so cute, she is tiny, and she's a cat that her little, like, town tune thing when you talk to her goes meow. Here. So cute, I love her. I can't believe you braved the rain to come and visit little old me. Oh yeah, I have a lost item. I should probably figure out who that belongs to. Definitely not Limburg. And if not, mm, screw him. Sorry Ty, this isn't mine. It's pretty cool and I'd really like to keep it, but yeah, it's not mine. We may have seen Phoebe with something like this before. Maybe. So that probably belongs to Phoebe. Really like that addition from New Leaf. Technically, in New Leaf, if you ever found a lost item, which was, I'm not 100% sure if that's a new addition from New Leaf. Um, but if you found a lost item, you'd have to go to all your villagers to try and find it. Hey, Phoebe. Yo, how's Operation Drumma Pipe from Cinnabar going? Still, still good, Sparky? Oh yeah, I've got something else here. I bet you'll like. Here you go. Never know what will happen with a wooden bucket hanging around. <laughs> she gave me the bucket, guys! Ah, she's telling me to hide my face. I look ugly. Like some bigwig could visit and it'll turn out they're a huge wooden bucket fan. What's that I look for? It could totally happen, Sparky. You're funny and cute. You again, Sparky? Did you forget something last time? You lost this. What, you found something? Let me see. Is this your book? Oh, no way! Where'd you find this? Did I drop it without noticing? Can't be. It, it can't have been easy to find this thing. I owe you big time for that. I got two things from Phoebe. I know it ain't much. It ain't much for all that hard work. But here's an oversized sweats dress. Cool. Give me a dress. All I can say is, uh... Thank you. Um, oversized sweats dress. Actually, let me get those uh, Nook Miles before I do anything. I'm so not used to... I guess you could say the menus in this game. It's kind of weird sometimes. Okay. Oversized sweats dress. Oh, that's cute. I like this. I like this a lot. It is super adorable for no good reason. I think I'm gonna wear this for the rest of the stream. Hey there, Genji. How's it going? Looking built, Mochi. What's up? I wanna chat. I'm not feeling this rain today. I'm just gonna stick indoor, stick to indoor workouts, Mochi. All cool, boy. You're good. So, um, relatively, I'm not so sure if this guy's a new villager to you guys or not, but I might as well go and introduce him anyway. Uh, his name is Zell, and I have no idea what animal he is, but I'm pretty sure it's like a deer. I'm not so sure. He is super classy. I love his plays. He's like... At first I thought I wasn't going to like him, but judging by his personality and the, the just the shit in his room, he seems like a guy who I'd probably want to go out and like, 
go to a jazz concert too. I love jazz. I love jazz so much. This guy seems like he's a guy with class, so I, I'm thinking about keeping him. What you making, Zell? Oh, Ty. Sorry, I was just doing a little DIY. I was in the zone, you know? So what you crafting? Glad you asked. Right now I'm making a wonderful and amazing ironwood clock. I've got the idea to make it from a crazy dream I had the other night. Do you want to hear more about it? Either the dream or the ironwood clock. Yeah! Uh-oh, I already forgot the dream. But I do have the recipe written down right here. You can have it. Yeah, boy. Give it a try, Ty. And if I can make this, anyone can. It's like cooking. Look at his outfit, actually. One second, let me... Look at this guy's outfit. He is classy as ever. He is super, super classy. Look at him. A little, like, vest, t-shirt, and a little dog tag. He is emanating class. He is so classy. I love him. I love him so much. So, other than the new additions, I'm pretty sure uh, the last stream I showed the Nook's Cranny, or at least I got it done. I am not 100% sure because the last stream I had of this, there was a power outage that cut off everything before it ended. So I'm just going to show you uh, the shopping district. Now right here, Nook's Cranny, let's see what's uh, let's see what's in stores today. Oh. Hello! Welcome to Nook's Cranny. So, we got a lawnmower. I already have one, but like, yeah, got a lawnmower. What's this? Spinning wheel. I'm not, I don't think that would suit me very much. A spinning wheel is kind of more of a sewing type thing even though I do have a sewing machine in real life I don't use it as much as I really should I want to use it more I want to make like stuffed animals and all that crap you know I'll pass a box of oranges <laughs> I can buy a cardboard box it's so fucking stupid these guys are probably these guys are acting like they're so low on money that they have to sell cardboard boxes. I just find that so ridiculous and cute. I think I already have a cassette player, so like, nothing too fancy today, in my opinion. Um, so that's practically just a small overview. Nook's Cranny's the shop in town. That's where you get all those fancy items. But now... Uh, there was a villager that came to my town. If you have not played Animal Crossing before, I'm just going to go over it as quick as possible. There's a villager. A villager, I guess you could say? Yeah, possibly. There's a shop owner that came to town. Name's Mabel. Uh, she sells clothes. And she is a adorable blue hedgehog. Not like Sonic the Hedgehog. Although she might be a porcupine. Either way, she's cute. She owns a shop where she actually... Uh, sews which is funny because you know porcupines have needles <laughs> or spines technically they're called either way uh i'm gonna show you the sh i gave um sorry either way i gave a lot of money to her thing and she's like yo i want to put shop here because everything's so profitable so i put her shop next to the nook's cranny and it is super cute and fucking adorable both words mean the same thing. I don't even know why I repeated it, but I love this place. So here we go. Let's go take a look on what's on sale today. Hey there! Welcome to Able Sisters, where we sell fashions made lovingly by Claw. What is... What are you doing here? What you buying today? I'm no good at shoes. I've tried them twice. Once on each foot, but these... 
Wickle pickers are cool. You wanna buy them? I'd wear them on stage, maybe. I guess Chrissy's really thinking, maybe I should buy them for her. Hmm. I wanna see if there's actually a one in pink. If there is one in pink or like light blue, I will get them for her. Oh, that's cute too. I love oh, that's so cute. <laughs> that is so adorable. I love it. Okay, let's see. Um, <laughs> I can give myself a little bunny nose. That's so. That's so adorably stupid. You can get tons of different clothes here. It doesn't seem like there are any types and will be registered as her color, so I will get white ones and I'll give them to her because I am a lazy butt who likes doing that stuff. It's not really much else of my style I'd like to get anyway. Unless, uh, hmm. Yeah, I know brown works. This looks so cute. I love him. Look at Sharp, thank you very much. I'll go ahead and ship what you were wearing before directly to your storage at home. Guess I'm walking out in the rain. Actually, just so I don't um, trigger some people, I'll take the socks off too. There you go, feet picks all the way for free. <laughs> hey, Chrissy. Apparently, someone from. I'm not gonna pronounce that, but kind of looks like a very TOS word. Design this. I'm Tresmez. Sparkles. Can I, can I give you the thing you really wanted? Excuse me. Can I. No, don't get it. Hi, Ty. What, what a quinky dink running into you here. Do you want this? You give me a thing? Yes. I heard you really want this. I'm giving it to you. Ah, some wickle pickers. You guys this me because I thought I, I got. Mm, it's, mm. English is not my strong suit, even though it's my main language. Did you get this because you thought I'd rock it? That makes me so happy! I'm totally feeling the love sparkles. Thanks a bunch, Ty. No problem. I love Billy. I love... I love her. I love her. One of my favorite characters in this entire game. Her. Sable. She is a very, very shy... Oh, she is a hedgehog. She's a very, very shy sister of Mabel. And she, um... It takes a while, but... She, Usually in the games, if you keep talking to her every day, she'll open up to you and it's super cute and adorable that she gets a friend and she's like, like she's super shy into herself and kind of lonely. And then the more and more you talk to her, the more she gets like happy to see you, I guess you could say. It, it's just super adorable. If you need something, could you talk to the other hedgehog, please? I'm gonna talk to you some more because I love you. Oh, sorry about that. When Sable's really focused, she gets a little, you know, prickly. Pun. No talking. Only sewing. Oh, whoops. I'm happy to help you with whatever you need. Just step away from the seamstress. Not gonna lie, that almost sounds like... <laughs> She'll stab me if I, if I go any closer. Sorry about that. Oh, that's a little repeat. One more time and I will go, I promise. Hey, Mabes, could you help this customer, please? Eh, I guess that's it. All I can say is, uh, I will see you later. 
Thanks. Please come again. I love these hedgehogs. I love hedgehogs in real life. I'm not gonna lie. This game gives me so many different feels. I want to get a pet hedgehog. But if I do right now, I know that it probably won't last long because I also have cats. And these cats really love this thing called um, eating everything. They even try to like bite at the dog. That's how much they uh, like eating everything. Snail. I serenade the snail. Okay. Um, so that's practically a base overview of my town. I also have this... Um, it took me a while to actually get this done, but I have created this sort of land of bells, which is practically just... I don't know. I'm still kind of working on it, but I like really this idea of this one place just devoted to like a golden thing, so it's like, this is the wealthy the wealthy forest or something like that. I don't know. Still coming up with a name. It took me a long time to get there, but hey. It's really cute. And it's something. It's it's really cute. <sighs> it's cute, adorable. I like it. So, um, that's not really what I meant to do. Let me put on a seize of seize my English is really gone today. I apologize. Let's put a reasonable type of clothing right now. So let's get changed. Uh, socks. Shoes. Actually, I like this jacket. This jacket for today seemed good. Oh, it works so perfect with the... Oh! Oh, that looks so perfect that looks so perfect with the pants okay i'm keeping it i'm keeping it i like it it's so adorable i i look so cute uh wrong thing i need to get in my storage okay so i have to i have to make a shovel So I'm going to do that right now. And I'm going to take care of, or like, trim my island. I'm going to make sure that everything's gonna be all right in my island. I needed hardwood. Maintain, take care. I'm going to make my island the prettiest non-edited island ever, <laughs> I guess. If that counts or works or whatever. Okay, so there's nothing more there. Uh, let me get um, let me get that hardwood. It looks so adorable. I love it. So, um, I know I probably haven't said this before. Oh, wrong thing. Oh yeah, I have no control over, I just, <laughs> I have no control over, um, anything when it comes to, like, I have no control over what I'm carrying when I'm inside my house. It's kind of fun. I totally forgot about that. I can't believe it. Hundred DIYs and <laughs> understand it. Wait, did I just say understand it authority? That's that's hilarious. Crafty club member. Okay. Wooden bucket. Sure, I'll place that around town. Um. I 
actually, let me see what the song is. Um, song I just got. This is a classic! I actually really like this. I'll, I'll keep it. Now, the real reason why I am not showing off my house as of right now... Well, I mean, I guess you could say more details into the house. Um, I'll quickly go over it right now, but it's really underdeveloped, and I'm really just making this comfortable as can be as of right now, and I'll improve on it later. Like, you see the bed right here with my little, like, um, design patterns that I have for my channel, my, uh, my twit, everything, pretty much, just me. I also have it on my phone, if you can see right here. Um, I also have my logo right there, a little futon for any of my friends who want to sleep in. Uh, my friend Clover actually gave this to me, and, well, I... Uh, all I can say is, if you're watching this right now, Clover, I thank a whole bunch of you, um, out of you for helping me uh, get stuff done in this town. Yeah, she helped me a little bit. <laughs> she even gave me this hamster. I love hamsters. I love little, small, rodent-like things that are cute. Like, I love rats. I love mice, even though technically I've never had a m mouse. Um, hedgehogs, ferrets... I mean, I mean, I even find raccoons cute, even though they don't even fall under the same line. They're kind of like small little panda bears. I mean, they're called trash pandas for a reason, you know? Um, Nintendo Switch right here, Betafish on top there, a katana, world map, a stereo with a little amp. Popcorn maker, rice cooker. Actually, let me drop this ocarina for a second. Um, a little rice cooker that has a little steam come up whenever you uh, open it, which is really cute. A microwave that spins. I need some. Uh, sorry, I'm just gonna eat this real quickly. Crafting table, pan and a furnace, not furnace, oven with stove, a toiletry, and a toilet that you can poop in. And that takes care of that. I know I probably showed the toilet before, but yeah, why not? It even flushes too. Security camera and a bunch of decorative stuff. So, um,. That's a small thing of my house, even though technically, it, for those who have been watching from the start, probably already know what's going on. So uh, let me get the let me get that shovel out and do some work. Uh, actually, one second. Instead of using the shovel, let me use the axe, because I don't like these trees being here. Trees are cute. Not my kind of boot. There we go. Usually whenever I see the um, little shining part that keeps coming out of the ground, it should be one of them should be down here like this. You get like a thousand bells from it, but... Uh, I will say not my cup of tea, or at least like right now I'm not doing that anymore because I currently like, I have a lot of, I mean you've seen before the golden land or whatever I'm gonna call it, I already have a lot of trees with bells in it, and like sure I might be getting 3,000 out of them, but like I have a lot easier time getting, uh, or take, getting money from like taking care of fossils, and I'm, al I'm almost done with all my fossils, so I'll be getting a lot of money from that anyway. And it's just a lot easier, and uh, even though it's really cute to get like 3,000 bells from a tree, I've technically used all the purposes of them from uh, making this part of the entire town. 
I might do more. I might be more sophisticated with it later. But as of right now, I, I'm currently done with all those trees. So I'll just keep them as a... I'll just keep them as is. Um, where was that again? Wooden bucket. Nope. That's not what I wanted to do. Push. Now I got a person making a sandcastle. Perfect. And then there's one right here. I'm going to take a big leap here. And totally drop a pair. That's not what I meant to do. I'm going to break this. If this has bells in it, it should give me 8,000. And... Yeah, boy! That's what I thought. 8,000. Now, um, this was the villager I'm talking about. I am going to do something that I should not show to stream. I'm going to hit him with a net. Be right back. She keeps walking away. I'm just gonna say right here, I don't condone animal abuse. <laughs> it's a bad thing. Don't do it. If you watch the stream at all, and you do anything that's of the line of animal abuse, real life animal abuse, you will be... Just don't watch me. You'll be banned. I... Stop. No. Animal Crossing... Eh, that's a different thing. They're, they're not animals. They're just villagers. <laughs> Line of process. Could you please not do that? I have no patience for that kind of immature behavior. I'm gonna make you lose your patience. What was that for? Do you have some kind of problem with me? That really hurt. You don't care about my feelings. Now for those who hate me for doing that. She was trying to take the spot of someone who was on my island. I did not want her. And this was the only way I could think of actually getting rid of her. It got rid of Limburg. I apologize. If this becomes like a problem and no one likes me doing it in later streams, I will cease from treating my villagers that way, even if I don't like them. But that's just me. I really never wanted that villager here, so I'm gonna try my best to get them to leave. And, I mean, it's really shitty, but it's the only way I could think of. I mean, I got Limburg out, so that's good enough for me. So, uh, let's just maintain this island a little bit. Let's get some fossils. not have bells in it. That should be fine. Eh. Three iron. Not bad. I don't have any fruit on me, so I don't think I'm going to be able to do anything. Hmm. That's a little bit of a shame, but hey. I could just grab it later. Anything up here? A pink rose, which is cute. Doesn't look like there's any fossils up here, though. Eh, that's alright. A snail's back. <laughs> that snail just, like, rolled off like Sonic the Hedgehog. Just, like, spin-dashed out of here. Imagine that, instead of a hedgehog, we got a snail. That'd be so funny. Oh, there we go. Fossil! Another 
fossil. Yeah! Now I'm surprised that, uh... I remember in New Leaf that there was a great abundance of pitfall seeds, but I don't see them in this game as much as I did in the earlier games. Which is really weird. In my, like, in my opinion, it's really weird that I am not really that able to find any pitfall seeds in this game in comparison. But it'd be cool to have them. Be one way to, like, spend an April Fool's Day, you know? That's what I did with the other game. Waited until I got a bunch of uh, pitfall seeds and then layered them across town. See which villagers would fall into what. Sorry for the yawn. I, uh, a little sleepy today. Getting up. Ooh! Who are you? I've never seen you on my island before. CJ. What's up, fish sinista? CJ here. Coming at you live from, uh, uh, right in front of you. <laughs> I'm touring the island looking for fresh faces and fresher fish to show off to my live stream. We got a streamer villager. That is, that's so adorable. I love it. That's kind of funny because I'm streaming right now too. That's funny. That's cute. That's adorable. I like it. Fishing is real. Fishing is reeling in all kinds of streaming numbers right now. Heard of esports? Well, this is esports. <laughs> this is this game's gonna kill me. This, this game is literally gonna be the death of me. Not Doom Eternal, not Near Automata, even though I don't have that game yet. Not Half Life Alex, not even VR Chat. No, it's just gonna be Animal Crossing New Horizons, the game that will kill me. Anyway, I need new fish if I want to keep my followers following. That's where you come in. If you got fish to sell, then I wanna buy. Simple as that. I'll even pay premium. Yeah. So you cash out, I get new selfies from my blog, and my viewers get to hear me talk fish. Everyone wins. So, how about a challenge, C-Sports style right now? I read that completely wrong. I apologize. How about a challenge, C-Sports style? Right now, win and I'll make it ring and talk you up on my stream plus my partners into making slick collectibles if you want one he's so talented <laughs> see sport challenges i want to see those fishing skills and i just know my viewers do too here's how it'll go i'll tell you what fish to catch and you'll get fishing but the hook is that it switches up each time gotta keep them guessing Plus, I can't afford another cheating scandal. <laughs> Alright. That's the dealio. Are you ready for sea sport action? Because it's challenge time. Today, my viewers want you to reel in three fi big fishes in a row. So, like, bard knife jawish in size or so. If you wow my viewers, I'll wow you with some serious bells. I'll buy those fish off of you like that. Sure, I don't think I've ever caught one, but why not? Not like anything can, anything bad could happen because of it. You got it, chum. Time to dive in and school this challenge. <laughs> All right, I want you to catch. I want you to catch three big time fish in a row, all about the size of a barred knife jaw. And critters like soft shell turtles or snappy turtles also count. They're pretty big, too. And don't go catch an undersized fish, or my subscribers will get mad. And there go your streaks. Oh, and don't let them slip off your streak, either. They'll cut your streaks, too. Sorry, chat request. I know, I know, m so many rules. But I gotta keep the folks happy, or my views will drop. Now go catching something. Yeah. I guess I have to catch three big fishes. Uh, now I know this is probably cheating, but let me, uh, check something real quick. What is 
a knife knife jaw animal crossing a barbed knife jaw can i actually catch one Ooh, it's super rare uh it's super expensive although it does live in the ocean that's good and it is the time of year it's just very rare that that will suck I don't have one <laughs> so that means I have to catch not just three or at least around three of the same size I have to quite literally catch four because I need to give one to blathers <laughs> oof that will be a challenge that's a big fish Do I have a fishing pole? Did I break mine? Oh, wrong button. I did not, but I don't know why my fishing pole is not in one of my items. That works. Um, before I catch fish, actually let me go and catch that one. I'll be amazed if it actually is one of those. Or it is um, a barred knife jaw. Give me the money! It's a sea bass. Well, at least it counts. That works. Time. I did not see that awesome there. Sorry, I just had to minimize something. like another big fish. Please be another big fish. That scared the shit out of me. Whoa! I'm pretty sure I've caught that before. Let me see the... Okay, so it is with blathers, so I don't need to worry about that. Oh, you're a biggie. I got you! I got you! A red! Wow, a red snapper! Pretty dapper. That was an easy challenge. I hit, keep hitting the wrong button. Apologize about that. It's just like, I still don't understand the control scheme they set up for this game. It's kind of like, odd in comparison to like Breath of the Wild where the control scheme feels natural. Like if they switched this to up here, or, like, it'll coincide with this wheel, which is right on the... Like, okay. The trigger opens up your phone, which, you know, it's alright. Um, but this menu right here is on the up D-pad, which is weird because a similar menu for the, like, reactions is right on the right trigger, if I said that correctly. And it's just so weird. Now with your challenge, dude. What's up, Fish and Easter? Picked a name for your Angular Sona yet? What? You caught three big time fish in a row already? Now that's gonna make the chat explode. So much for my Sea Sports challenge. I need a fish. 
Photo op. <laughs> CJ, I love you. Please never leave my island. Way to wreck that sea sports challenge. What a haul. Hey, want to sell any of those fish? Because I want to buy. I've got bells for nautical miles, so chime on in. Yes, please. Yes, Fly Fisher. Show me what you want to sell. Hopefully my voice I'm doing for him is not cringy and really adorable. Oh, you got a whole school for me. Altogether, that'll be... 5,850 bells. Deal? Sold. Splash. Make my new viewers happy, and I'll make you happy. Let's make it ring! Yeah. You are so cute. Please never leave my island. I love you, I love you, I love you, I love you, I love you. You are a cute little... Otter? Oh, you're a beaver. I'm an idiot. You're a cute little beaver. Never leave my island. I like cute things. Okay, so, um... Sorry, I just wanted to do that. Um... I have a lot of fossils in my inventory. Let me go give them the blathers so I can get some money. I think money. <laughs> money, money. In some way. Okay. Hey, blathers. Wake up. It's time to wake up, blathers. Wake up. Wake up. Oh dear, pardon me. Why, hello, Ty. Welcome to Cinnabar Museum. Today, in honor of International Museum Day, we're holding a stamp rally. It works thusly. They, the bug, fish, and fossil gatherers each will have three stamp stations. You'll find them within the galleries and acquire the necessary stamp to earn a prize. You have to earn three unique prize. You can earn three unique prizes, one for each competing the rally for each of the three galleries. Ooh, it's true. Do be sure to give a, it while pursuing the museum's many fine exhibit, exhibits. Oops, sorry about that. I might actually have to take him up on that offer. But first, I want to make sure I get the fossils taken care of. Here you go. Ooh. Well, the one I see. Let's take a closer look, shall we? Yes, indeed. Quite splendid. Alas, our museum already has these, such as these. I am indeed tempted to purchase these for my personal collection. But no, I must exercise restraint. Return them to you now. Is there anything else I can help you with? Uh... Do I seriously have we seriously have all those in stock? Ooh, thank you very much. My feathers. Why, well, it seems you have nothing on your person that we can accept at this time. We accept donations of bug, fish, and officially assessed fossils, as well as work of some art. If you acquire any of these items, please do consider donating them. So I guess we ha I mean, I guess we don't actually have uh we already have them in stock, I mean. Wow. At least I got some miles out of that. What's this? Oh, it's just sell another item. Let's do that a uh, stamp challenge thing. That might actually be fun. Or it might be silly, but either way, hopefully I'll have some fun with it. Stamp, mollusks and arthropods. No backbone, but still tough, I bet. Oh. So I have to go to each stamp station in this entire place and get them stamped. That is, I could do that. And we'll get to see the completion 
so far of my museum. Now mostly, the thing I have the most complete is practically all the fossils here. You can see there are more, there are allotted here, even though it's not complete. Um, you know, it's filled. <laughs> like, they look like they're almost complete. So, uh, I'm almost done with all these. I just have to find the rarer ones. You know, I actually really like what they did with the exhibit in Animal Crossing in this game. They actually made it look like an exhibit rather than just a rooms filled with fossils. Then again, I'm pretty sure they put more fossils in here than, well, the original games, but I can't confirm that. Um... I really can't confirm that, but it actually looks like an exhibit down to the point of like evolution here. Like these lines actually mean something when it comes to parts of their evolution, including cats coming from saber tooth tigers, then dogs, bears, I think that's a giraffe, rhinos, pigs, uh, more rhinos? That might be a hippopotamus, actually. Cows, deer, bunnies, mice, monkeys, and villagers. <laughs> and that's really cute. It's really awesome that they went to this much amount of detail to make something look like, well, this place actually looked like a museum in comparison. And they even have these like little blue spots where the camera changes quite a bit, which is really cool. You get to see more of the museum that way, or at least in the way that, like, they, uh, the game makers would want to show you. Like, there, it's those I showed you right there. My favorite one, actually, is this spot right here, because... All I could say is... <laughs> yeah... And that's how the dinosaurs died, kids, but not really confirmed yet, but really a lot of people are, will say it anyway. So I got those amount of stamps done. Let's try and get the bugs and then the fish next before meeting blathers. Now when it comes to the bugs and the fish, because since, because I have to catch them, I don't have that much really. I do have a f quite a few, but not enough to actually, like, gloat about. <laughs> it's just really hard to find a lot of bugs, which is kind of, I guess, kind of the point. <laughs> this game will make, like, last for a while, and sometimes it, like, there's tons of fossils that appear each day, but the amount of bugs that appear is kind of random. It's more random than the fossils, anyway. <laughs> Because the fossils are buried, they have to, um... Like, they're in a certain spot. They won't leave as soon as you leave the screen. Um... Practically, you can dig them up any time and they'll still be there. When the bugs and the fish... When you leave the screen, they're gone. And... How you catch them is based on an RNG. That, that I guess, could be similar to Pokemon, in a sense. Where it's just like, oh yeah, you you won't know what the fish is until you caught it. Which kind of is the same with fossils, except I guess there's just more of an abundance of fossils in a way. In, in comparison to at least these fish. Or at least like the RNG is a bit better because... Um, <laughs> a little can. Um, the RNG is a bit better because... I guess it's full on like 100% random each time for the fossils. Oh, I caught a lot of butterflies. I didn't realize that. That's super cute. Uh, I mean, most of them are repeats by the look of it, but those are very cute. I like it. Um, but like fish and fish and bugs might have a different variety away where's the other stamp did i skip it oh it's right over there there we go that's simple let's take care of this coconut corner 
There we go. Now time to get to the fishies. A cute little owl. I don't want him to interrupt his sleep. He's he he's very happy. So you can see even here I didn't really catch that much fish. I mean it's not a bad thing, it's just really hard RNG at this point. At least I got a beta. Speaking of beta. Well that's such a cute that's such a cute quote. Little guy's just chilling in his little tank. Must be nice. Serenity. <laughs> this game is too cute for words. Uh, the only word that can describe this game sometimes is literally just cute and I can't help it. Throw us a little dry, I gotta take a drink. <sighs> Sorry about that. So let's get this stamp, the coast. <laughs> Sorry about the mic there, but that's just... Oh my goodness, these are so stupid, I love them. These, these are the kinds of jokes I would make, and this is why I like Animal Crossing so much. All the puns, or all the jokes, the, the humor, the humor, and the cuteness, and it's just so much. I like die over this shit, man. Must not let fish know I'm craving sushi. Hopefully that sounded funny. So I got that done. And look. Hi Red Snapper. Wow, this is really beautiful. When did I catch that fish? A little flat fish there football fish I don't know what it's called I don't remember catching that maybe one of my friends uh, donated it we'll never know okay so last one has to be somewhere around here if am I dumb Maybe it's in the first room, just like longer. Let me check down here. shouldn't have gone left I should have gone up maybe I don't know anything about this museum <laughs> about everything here so let's see is it right up here it is the last one no you don't don't swim in around coral reefs that will possibly destroy them and then we won't have them anymore the sad fact of life is that we can't really, you know, touch everything. End up hurting the environment. It's kind of that shit, you know? We as human beings should learn how to take better care of our environment. Better care of our environment. If we don't, oh, well, we just won't have it anymore. That's a sad fact. Oh, sorry about spooking you again. By my, by my peak, seems like you have finished the stamp rally in the bug exhibit. Your willingness to explore bug rooms with such gusto is admirable. I myself find lingering that quite impossible. Anywho, here's your prize I was promised. Ooh. Jolly good, I shall present you with the completion stamp. Hey. 
Now, should you find yourself exploring the other exhibits, do try to collect the stamps there. Someone such as yourself is sure to find it a worthy pursuit. Uh, what did he give me? I got a tape recorder. That's weird. Don't fall asleep. I, I completed it. Who, I say who? Look at that, you finished the stamp rally in the fish gallery. I say, did you happen to take any photographs on your crest? Your knock phone takes marvelous photos, and the fish room makes an elegant backdrop to be sure. What, what? Oh, of course. There's that prize we were promised. Jolly good. I shall present you with the completion stamp. I feel like I'm not consistent with these voices, but I kind of don't care. Now, should you find yourself exploring the other exhibits rooms, do try to collect stamps there. Someone such, such as yourself is sure to find it a worthy pursuit. My feathers! You finished the stamp rally in the fossil gallery! As the host of these rallies, it pleases me to my pin feathers to see you frolic amid the fossils. So, indeed, with a great pride, I shall present you with the prize you were promised. I'm getting a last step from this bird. Jolly good. I shall present you with your completion stamp. What, what? You've collected all the stamps available today. I think you've really enjoyed the stamp rally to such a degree. I can't help but puff my feathers with pride. I thank you, and I hope you continue to revel in all this museum has to offer. I like your museum, bird. You, you're cute, bird. You're cute. You deserve the work and the money and the sleep you get. I am dumb. I'm gonna go. <laughs> Bet you guys tell I have no idea how to talk to people. Anyway, uh, that's what I get from a tape recorder, a fish plaque, fossil plaque. Wait, I didn't get a tape. What did I get? Oh, I got a pl I got plaques for it. Oh, let me put them in my uh, my house. My plaque house. My house plaque. Uh, let me do it like this. Wrong Actually, for a villager. <laughs> Here we go. All the plaques I need. Actually, let me see if I can center it a bit better. Because, like. There we go. That looks beautiful. I also have a plaque right here. Maybe I should. There we go. That looks. That looks decent, right? Yeah. That looks pretty good. What's this tape player, by the way? I don't remember buying it, but I guess I did. Oh, I probably won it. Why do I have this? Either way, it's kind of cute. I, I like it. I'll put it in storage, though. Um... I have a floor light, I'm gonna plan on doing something for it later. Let's just put all these little things in storage before I go. Okay, there we go. And uh, let's see if I can pay off some of my house. 
Or actually, before I do, the nook shopping on the PC. Let's get that taken care of and then, uh, I guess advance on to the next day or maybe something else. Who knows? Oh, wait. Missed it. Oops. Not going to the nook shop, going to the town hall. See what I can do. There's nothing there, so I just won't take care of that. Let's go to the next stop. Hey, let's see what's for sale. Garden faucet, have it. Garden lantern, have it. Outdoor hat, don't have it. Don't care. Oval glasses, don't have it. Don't care. Halo tee, I think I have it. Zigzag, I don't want to try. Sweatpants, okay. Eh. Jazz. I don't think I have it, but I really want it, so I'm going. Actually, let me check first. I don't think I have KK Jazz yet, I don't, I don't think. Worst comes to worst, I can always sell it again. I always want to make sure I have all these, you know, things. I will get myself a few Nooks Miles tickets before I go. Um, might actually want to go visit a couple of islands. I mean, that sounds like fun, right? Maybe I can get someone to uh, come to my t uh, like camp. If I got Raymond, that would be interesting. So I'll get like three. Three sound good. Yeah. Everything's looking good. Cool. So I'm good with all of that. And, uh, wait, oops. Another thing. Let me pay off my loan. <laughs> Okay, so now I should be alright. I can probably get another room with that. Okay, looks good to me. So let's go and uh, use those tickets, actually. Put them to good use. Put them to good use. Actually, before we do, I still have the fossils, don't I? Let me uh, organize them a bit and sell them. Picking the items up in this game are actually is a lot different and I would say difficult in comparison to the previous game because you have to hold A and sometimes it doesn't register that you're holding it for some reason, which I don't understand, but hey. It was so easy before you just click A. 
but no, I guess that drops items. No. A. But I guess not. Um, eh, some things have to change, you know? Hello, I'm back. I'm here to sell some bone. Take my bones, boy. Take all my bones. Oh! That's a lot of bells! Can't go to cool egg. Sold. That's a lot! Now you see? See what I mean? I know I said this earlier in the stream. But getting money from fossils is actually way more profitable than it looks. Uh, some people get money through turnips. I, that might actually be a better way, but I really hate stock. So, I'm gonna do it with fossils because I know that's actually a profitable revenue source. I wanna sneeze on you. Not yet. I'll do it later, though. Excuse me. Hey, hey, hey! Welcome to your one and only gateway to the skies. The Cinnabar Airport. How can I help you out today? I want to fly. Roger. By the way, it looks like you got one of those Nook Mile tickets on you. In that case, you should feel like using that. So, just get all the paperwork official. Where did you want to go? I'm going to use the ticket. So you want to use your Nook Miles ticket. Roger. I'm ready to get you in the sky right this minute. But let's just check if see if you're all packed with your tools. I'm ready for takeoff. Alright, let's get airborne. I went from... New York to Chicago to Cowboy. That totally sounds like me. Dota 1. Uh, yeah, I couldn't read that. That's cool. Okay, have a good flight, friend. Feel like you need to travel? Just think, what would the Dodos do? They would fly. Dodo arrow. Alright. Uh, two down. Docked at the target station. Delta Oscar, Delta Oscar is go. Meanwhile, I'll be holding the pattern here. Get in touch when you need tools or trap. Go and catch some bees, chop some trees. I am here. Now. Whoa! I haven't seen that before. Can I. Is there a physical way for me to get across? I have never seen something like that before. Although I will take these roses. I might need them for my my golden golden isle. Wow. I guess that's one way to do it. This this looks what does this island look like? even anyone here? This is just an abandoned island. Yeah, I totally wanted that weed. I didn't pick up weed there. Okay, cool. So weird. Um, I'll deal with that in a second, but let me get this fish. Come 
Come on. Big boy, be a big boy. What is a big boy? I think it's an olive flounder. That's the one I talked about before. I caught it. I don't think they cost too much, so I'll just release it. Um, let me see if I can break that rock. So I'm going to get a couple pairs so I can eat. And build my strength up so I can do that. Actually, let me get more. Multiple rocks there. Hopefully I can get over there. Nope. Yeah! What kind of... What kind of ritual is this? Oh. I already almost threw in this thing, so let me just... Yeah. I wasted time on that. If they... Do they all have that? If they do, then I just got, I got bank. Oof. Uh. I did get bank. I got a lot of bank. expect to get in this island. This pays off my house really quickly. And I got a fossil too. This is, this is a weird place. I don't know if I should say I like it, but it's very weird. <laughs> I'm glad I like I got a bunch of money. That's not far enough. Get my reel! Oh my god. I have to uh, pull the cross. Come here! Come on, let's go and get some shit. I can do this. I'm a talented fisher. I'm a talented fish. Oh, it's another sea bass. Oh, it's a carp. I don't... Did I catch a carp before? Oh, it's actually new. That is unique. Wow. Can't believe I haven't caught one before. Don't you turn away from me. I am offended that you are a fish. Qu qu quit it! Yo, boy! Lobster. Did I catch that before? Oh, okay. Crawfish is new, too. I did not expect that. Hmm. This must be the Lucky Island. Have a new a recipe for a tire? <laughs> well, that's kind of cute. I'll hold on to the tire. 
I never thought that that would be put into a recipe. That's a clever way of making trash useful. Don't do that. Don't do that to me. Come on, be something. Ooh. Rancho goldfish, but I prefer a bals balsamic. A balsamic. A balsamic cool goldfish. I think that's how it's supposed to be pronounced. That's fucking funny. These are new fish. I have never seen these breeds before. Frog! Or it's a new neighbor. And I <laughs> have some apologizing to do. Oh, I'm sorry, puppy. Oh, it looks like my inventory is not gonna be. Uh, Difficulty anytime soon. This is fun. I'm happy. This this was a great idea. This was a great idea. Command fishies. Eat 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 the f eat eat the stuff. Another crawfish. The more the merrier, I say. Oop. Meant to do this. Nope. There we go. A killer fish. Streams are safe. Ooh. <laughs> That's a joke. I never expected the Animal Crossing to make. First time me for me to ever experience an island like this. Big fish. Please be something new. It's sea bass. Seems like one of my friends is playing Animal Crossing. I wonder if I should send her a message. I got one. I got. I sh I should send her a message. I'm gonna do that. I got a stupid question or a stupid message. Boy, it. <laughs> Temmy. Because Undertale's very funny. Maybe. Hopefully she got that. Either that or I just really did something terrible. Terribly wrong, I mean. Tiny fish. So now for the ocean fish, we're just getting regular ocean fish by the look of it. Giant clamp. Need that for a project. 
the bugs in this island are not too unique. Which is not a bad thing. It just means that probably there's another island with more different bugs. It probably also doesn't help the fact that I always I always set my time during the day. So I don't get like unique event stuff like Tarantula Island, which I think only happens at night. You, oh, fuck you, dude. You don't get try to do. I've never... I never th thought you could eat a coconut. Let me see. Maybe you can. I didn't expect that. Okay. I think I got all that I could actually get out of this island. There are bees on the shore. Oh, yeah. So I'm going to head off. The bottom mariachi. This is stovetop beach towel. Do you acquire assistance? Over. You ready to punt, platoon, and fly? <laughs> Soaring pansy here back to Cinnabar. You positive. Be very positive. Because I wouldn't want to leave anything behind. So again, you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Roger. Lifting. Lifting off November Oscar Whisker. I love how they say Whisker because they can't really say Whiskey. November. Oscar. They think he's a sick dude. I'm not gonna lie, I watched um, Ferris Bueller recently, so I don't know why the, 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 the principal's assistant is on my mind now whenever I think of someone being like, I don't know, it just, she's on my mind now. It's always been funny to me. November, Oscar, Whisker, we got it. I think that's just a Canadian accent, actually. Oh, cool, I got a, ooh. I already knew that. I got a recipe from Drift. He is one of my ami uh, amiibo cards. Let's get all these plants out of the way. And, uh, let me see if I can do sh stuff. Bird, I got fish. Who? Oh dear, pardon me. Do you have a look around? No rush, take your time. Uh, but first, how may I assist you? Oh wait. Yeah, I do have a fossil. Hey, what would you like me to assess? I'm a whole flutter. I really hope my accent is not cringy whatsoever. And completely cool. Here you go. Let me see here. Hmm. Indeed. Ooh! After some consideration, I can safely declare this fossil to be a saber-toothed tail. A saber-toothed tail. Quite remarkable indeed. If only I could take it off your hands, alas, we already have one. So I must return it to your care. So anything else I can help you with? Make donation. Marvelous! Oh, do you like to donate? Fish, 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 fish. Oh! Several things I see. Let's take a look. Splendid! We'll take. We'll gladly take these off your hands. Ah! I need to pull them all out. I'll handle the rest from here. Now I see you're donating multiple of the same item. Though we need only one, you may have the extra. Is there anything else I can help you with? I'm good now. Jolly good. Please enjoy the rest of your visit. 
inconsistent voices. I need to like create a consistent voice for almost all my villagers. That is not annoying and somewhat cute. Although I... Oh my goodness, he's purple. You look cute, you look cute, even though I probably saw you this earlier, I just want to say you look cute. Hey, yeah, uh, it's raining, but I'm attacking the day anyway. You too, huh, Mochi? Let's chat. Someone said that I can't swim and that I sink like a brick when I'm in, wa in the water, Mochi. Not cool. I sink because I'm weighed down by too much muscle, not because I can't swim. It's a good problem. <laughs> Ignore your problems and they shall go away. <laughs> Funny. Okay, let's uh let's see. I can sell a few things, right? Yeah. Let's do that. that works. Okay. So I should be good right now. Let's visit another island and see if um See if we can get more stuff done. Let me just organize this a little quickly. Hey, hey, hey! Welcome to the one and only gateway to the skies, the Cinnabar Airport. How can I help you out today? I want to fly. Roger. By the way, it looks like you got one of those Nooks Miles tickets on you. In that case, feel like using it, so just get all the paperwork done. What'd you want to do? Use the ticket. Well, we're going through all this again. I don't really need to repeat myself, but I just kind of want to have fun with it. I'm ready to get you in the sky right this minute, but let's check if you're all packed. I'm ready. Alright, let's get you airborne. Need to get you airborne. I need to figure out an accent for this fucking dodo. <laughs> fucking dodo. Dodo. I make myself laugh, and that's really a problem. I need to make. I need to make others laugh. But who's listening to me at this hour? That's my question. Who knows? Anyway, let's do this. <laughs> I love that the wings flap when the engine starts going. That's so cute. Okay, let me get going. Okay, so is there a villager on this island? Please say yes, it doesn't look out of the ordinary. That's a, oh, that's one I had before. Okay, uh... There's rocks here, there's fish here, is there a villager here? No! Surprisingly. That's odd. Unless they're over here, but... What? Is it because my town's too filled? Eh. Whatever. Oh. No. There we go.
just so I can get rid of that uh, little food. Gotta get materials somehow. Good. Al Gad. All good. Let me eat a pear. And uh Bob. Bob's your uncle. No, that's not what I wanted to do, but okay. Now this one might be tricky because I can't really see most of it. No! Oh, God damn it. Maybe I should I should always check and see if like I have um, I should always just use the axe, not the, not anything else. If I use the axe, no, stone axe, if I use the stone axe, I will not miss it. Have an easier time with that. Um, Shake this tree down, get some pears, and let's get a shovel out, take care of these, not you, but okay, I guess you, I can grab you too. You know, these flowers, it would be nice if I can like get some actually like golden flowers. If that becomes a possibility in the game, I will replace all the yellow flowers with golden ones. Because it'll look prettier. Gold! That's perfect. Rarely get any gold nuggets, but uh, really glad I got one now. fruit and um yeah get rid of that Sad that there's no villagers here. I really like some more. Or at least one to replace um the ones I don't want. Well, oh, I guess that's all I'm gonna get out of these rocks now. Thing. Um, I'm not gonna waste my last miles ticket. Instead, I will actually scan an amiibo for my last thing. I feel like we actually are getting really close to the end of the stream. I have been doing it for around almost two hours now. So I think 
I think um, after I do the thing for my amiibo villager, I will sign off. That sounds like a good idea. I prob I would really like to stream until like, because like right now it is midnight. I would really like to stream to one o'clock or two o'clock, but that would require me taking out another day of Animal Crossing. Like I would have to advance to another day. Maybe. I don't know. It, it depends on how I feel about uh, the Amiibo Villager. Um. Yeah, it depends on the day. Thank you, guys. Now, uh, let me go take care of these flowers and see how everything goes. Gotta place them right here. Plant. Plant. better now. Okay. So let us, uh... Yeah, see what we can do with that amiibo villager, because I want a villager to replace Limburg without having to do that much work. But before then, be right back. No, 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 no. I don't want to deal with you. I want to do this. Sorry about that, guys. I had to take care of a little sticky situation. Um, it's all good, though. So, uh, let's invite a villager to our town. Who are we gonna invite, in fact? Uh, wait, Isabel, need help there? Guess you just wanna take your break, I guess. To the two viewers who are watching, anyone can guess um, who? Who might be this person I'm going to be adding to my village? Well, he is small, he is soft, and he's full of stuffing. And this is not uh, any sort of creepy villager. It is. Scan. Come on. There we go. It is Stitches! Yes, I would like to invite him to my campsite. Look at this soft baby boy. Hi, it's Stitches. What's up? Hi, by the way. I was so excited when I got... When I answered, I forgot to say. I know lots of ways to say hi, 
So you're the right guy for a greeting. Let's see. Hola, salut, ciao, and ni hao. Alon, guten tag. Anyong, konnichiwa. I can't even read that. Saluton. Namaste. Shikamu. And, um, hi. So what's your deal? Did you call just to say hello, or is there something else? Huh? Come to your campsite? Okay, I'll be right over. If I had a plush of him, I would die. Okay, so let's see how I can get him to my campsite. What? Oh, I forgot he's wearing purple. Knock knock, I'm coming in. How will I get you to live with me? What's up, little baby? Thanks for the call. I'm really happy you invited me, Stefan. Man, isn't this tent great? It's a real easy one that you gotta... that you pull out of your pocket and pop it right up. The hard part's when I gotta go home. It's really hard to fold up. I don't think I can do it alone, Stefan. Look at him with his little hot dog. Oh wait, no, this is a sandwich. Man, I really want to see some large cardboard boxes made by the folks here. I can make it happen, I have cardboard. Wait, you can do it, really? Yeah, this is so cool. This works! If I don't have enough cardboard, I can actually just buy it. Oh! I can do this. I'm gonna do this for you, little baby. Look at him, he's so cute. I have problems. I have a lot of problems. So let's see if I can get that done. Actually, I have the recipe right here. What does it require? It's all the way up here, right? Five cardboard boxes. How many do I... Oh, hey, dude. What's up? Have you been using reactions? I'm gonna teach you a real good one today. Has anyone said you don't have as many crumbs on you today? But you're too bashful to say thanks? No worries. Just do this. I got a blushy. See? You, you can tell I'm real flattered even though I haven't said anything. From now on, if you need to, just use bashfulness and everyone will understand how you feel. I love it. It's cute. Oh, that's so cute. I love it. Thank you, boy. I didn't talk to you today, Cranston. I just want to chat. I heard there's someone visiting a campsite right now. I wonder what they're like. Do you think they like cheesecake? Most likely, if I know stitches. Maybe I'll go see if they have some. <laughs> I think Cranston just wants to steal cheesecake from people. <laughs> this little cheesecake thief. You know what? You're alright. <laughs> so let's see how many cardboard boxes I have. I want to get this stuff done! And have my uh, little villager friend join in. I want him in, in, in my village. In my village. Now, come here. Okay, so how much do I have? I have two cardboard boxes. How many can I, I also have a cardboard sofa. And that, I'll move all those in. Um, let me buy more cardboard. I need the cardboard. We need a cardboard. I make weird noises. I apologize if that's creepy. A 
I'm on a mission. I'm on a mission to make a bear a cardboard, a large cardboard box. I'll take your entire stock. So now I should have one, two, three, wait, no, three, four, five. Cool. So let me go and make that and give that to him. Oh, this is so easy. I love stitches. He's so cute. He's so tiny. He's so cute. He's so tiny and cute. I love tiny and cute things. I love teddy bears. I love... Uh, I know this is not very... Some people don't find it really cool that, like men like cute things but just like fuck those people you know men can like cute things they can like soft things i have an adorable baby kitten and i melt over seeing him every time and he knows it and he uses it to get treats i love him so much he might be becoming fat because i love him so much <laughs> Okay, so let me go craftable for the large cardboard boxes. I did it! Thank you, Tom. I made a box. Okay, now let's go give this to him. You guys know what that is um then you're in the official snapping squad ow sometimes that hurts ah <laughs> oh, now my hands are numb that was not a good idea <laughs> I also have really bad joints I don't know why I did that Look at him in his little coffee! I'm so sorry. I need to take a picture of this right away. Oh, he's so cute. I love it so much. Okay. Hey there, Stitches. You look really happy. Did you make that thing we talked about? You know it. Yeah, your boxes. Want to hear a story I'll tell you? Want to hear a story? I'll tell you a story. The story goes like this. One day, someone from Cinnabar thought, large cardboard boxes. And then they ran to a DIY bench and made their thought to a thing. I don't know if that's a true story, but man, it's inspiring. <laughs> let, me, uh, let me give you my rubber apron as a thank you. Thanks for the real great souvenir. I love this island so much. I hope you'll invite me again. The island is cozy. Everyone's nice. They smell good. They feed me stuff. Man, I could stay here forever. Why not live here? That sounds cool. Invite me again sometime. Come on, Stitches. Come on. Large cardboard boxes you made me. It was real nice. Real nice. Thanks again, Stefan. Live in my town! I want you to live in my town, come on! I want you to replace my stinky drunk rat! Come on! Come on! I want... I have to try again tomorrow. Oh. Is this also like a bed, or is this just space? <sighs> Not gonna be my town today, or tomorrow. Actually, I might be able to get him tomorrow, so... It might not be a bad thing. I really don't want to go yet. 
What else can I do? What do I have? What does this apron look like? Oh my goodness, I look like binging with Babish, except with hair. That's kind of cute. I like it. I'll keep it because I'm also wanting to make a kitchen for my house. So, that sounds like a good idea. Actually, since I'm here... Let me make a... Let me give the thing I want to give to Rosie. Ever since she came to this island, there's this thing she's wanted, and I wasn't able to give it to her because I just couldn't yet. So I'm gonna give it to her now. Folks say my place is super comfy. I hope it's true. I work hard for that. Not working very hard, look. You want this? Ooh, what is it? It's a personalized paw print door plate. Here you go. Wait, for realsies? A paw print door plate? Thanks, Ty. I've low key wanted something like this for a while. I'll put it up sometime. I'll totally change the vibe of my place. So exciting. And here I'll trade you. It's a sleeveless tunic. I love to wear those. I I heard you love you love those. Depending on the tunic. What is it, silly? She calls me silly. So cute! What's the latest? Everyone's talking about how you were out fossil hunting yesterday. Did you show Blathers your finds? It's so wild that a bunch of critters used to live on this island. I can't wait to find some more of those. So what does this look like? Cute. Although it looks like piss. Like, it's straight up piss yellow. Although it kind of works with my attire, except not the shoes. Okay. Surprisingly, this actually matches the room. <laughs> I gave her this by accident. I didn't mean to. But hey, at least she has another chair. Uh, hopefully she's willing, like, there's one of those days where I could sell. This is why I want the rat out. She just said that, like, the neighbors complain. The only neighbor she has is literally that fucking rat bastard. He is literally a rat! I want him out! And he's getting out. He doesn't deserve her. So, um... Let me put my bear tea back on. There we go. Hmm. I wonder what else I could do today. some stuff in here. Sticks I don't really need. That. Yeah. Yeah. Good. And that'll go to my, um, thing. Hmm. This is Genji. I'm gonna check up on, uh, what's your name? Chrissy? I'm gonna check up on Chrissy. I wonder if she's making something. No, nah, she's just hanging. Oh. <laughs> she just decided to work at her desk. That's cute. Let me, uh... I'm gonna take a picture of her.
She really does not like that magazine. I wonder. <laughs> this looks really stupid. Ah, oh, fuck. I can't get a good angle on this. I guess this is good enough. Yeah, that's kind of cute. I like it. How you doing, Chrissy? Oh my gosh. Welcome. Let's chat. Cats visiting. Want to hear something low-key fab back home? They're known as Happy Home Relocated. That's Lay It Bonkers, right? I need to get a shiny new title, too. Every pop star should have one, Sparkles. By the way, Cats is my mom. Uh... Ever since the whole, like, quarantine business, um, my mother got this game to pass the time a lot quicker. I probably actually have said this before. She plays the game a lot. I'm really proud of her. I'm just gonna leave it as that because I'm pretty sure I have talked about it before. It's one of the things I'm... I'm happy my mom's doing something to, that makes her happy, you know? It doesn't happen a lot doesn't happen a lot. It really doesn't. But hey, you know, it's happening. And I'm happy. Wait, did I miss? Is that a fossil? I think I missed one. Wow. Well, I never really visited that this section of the island, I guess. Uh, shovel. There we go. So let's get this fossil assessed, because I think I did most of what I could do in a day. I'll advance on to the next day, maybe that's a good idea. And for those who think time traveling is nonsense, well I got through everything I could do in this day in around two hours. I kind of want to spend a little more time on stuff, maybe? I mean, how is it looking right now? You know what? I'm kind of sleepy right now. Maybe I'll just call it off after all this. It's all good. I had a really fun night. So, uh, after I'm done with, uh, you know, organizing things, packing things away, I'll, um, I'll pack it up. And I will, then we'll raid another stream. That should sound really nice. We already have this one too. Oof. I wonder if this, how much this one will sell for. Actually, I have no idea how much a gold nugget can sell for. Always one way to make sure. I thought she was way bigger than she was. I was scared for a second. It was just like Purple Godzilla, or not Purple Godzilla, Purple King Kong just like running at me. That would be scary. Ugh. I want to sell. How much is gold? Let me know. Let me see how it is with the fossil. I already have one in storage, so I will just take all this. 
So close, so close. I need I need to sell more things. What can I I could pay off my entire debt today. I I need to sell more things. What if I sell fruit? I'll sell fruit. I just need like around three thousand to four thousand more. Fruit. Fruit can get me that much, I'm pretty sure. I already have like a lot of fruit um, planted already. I don't think the fruit go bad unless like they go bad in my pocket. And usually the fruit that go bad very easily, I guess. I guess the only fruit that can actually go bad are the perfect fruit. Like over a certain time to get rotten. But that's only if they're on the tree. I think. If I am correct. Not sure though. I'm just gonna use the Dropbox to check. 800. This will work out. Uh, I'll do it today. By the way, if you hear that, that's my dog. Whenever he wants outside, he... I, I most likely said this before. Whenever he wants outside, he screams. <laughs> well... He doesn't really scream, but he barks really loudly just to uh, get our attention. And usually it's because there's a fox outside or the raccoon. And like, I don't care. I mean like, I don't mean like I don't care about him. No, I mean more like at the sake of... More of the sake of Spencer doesn't want to go outside to go pee. He, he just wants to harass the animals that live out there. And that ends up being a problem. So, uh... We just kind of ignore him for certain hours, but we do let him out in certain hours just so he can go to the bathroom. And most of the time, he doesn't want to go to the bathroom. He just wants to uh, chase the raccoon. You know, normal pet stuff. Stuff you have to, like, figure out as a pet owner. Confusing stuff. So let's get rid of this alone. Yeah. Boom! <laughs> Tom looks like, yay! Tom Nook is... Tom Nook's like, Yay! <laughs> Yay! Now I can put more dead on you! Yay! Hilarious. Now let's, uh... Let's talk about renovations. Well, hello there, Ty. Congratulations! You are a proud owner of a luxurious-sized, paid-in, full home. I can't imagine the feeling of satisfaction you must have. Truly, what could be better? Hmm? Well, I suppose you could have another room. That might technically be considered better. Oh, don't mind me. I, I simply can't help myself. But do come in if you want to... If I've piqued your interest. Yes. Ah, Ty. Hello, hello. This is the Construction Consultation Center. How may I help you? About my home. Time to talk about your home, hmm? What shall we discuss? I want to expand. Well, for your home, I would... I think adding a new room would be nice. So if we added one on the back, it won't change the look of the home. But you'll have so much more space. So it'll keep the construction costs down, relatively speaking. This... whoa. <laughs> this will require taking out a loan for... 348,000 bells. Do you think... What do you think? Do you want to proceed? Yes. 
Excellent. I'll get to construction right away. Everything should be ready for you tomorrow morning. So excited. Exciting indeed. I'm... Wow. This is gonna be awesome tomorrow. I don't know if I'm gonna stream tomorrow. Maybe. Maybe not. Depends on how I feel. I'll let you guys know though. I'll keep you guys in the in the know if I decide to stream tomorrow on my Twitter. Uh, Twitter link should be down below. If not, you could actually um, it should be up on my banner right up above. It's gaming with Ty. Practically no capitals. Gaming with Ty YT because both gaming with Ty and Ty games are already taken. I actually really want to get the gaming with Ty um, Twitter, but I. You know, the, the little at. I really want to get the Gaming with Ty at, but I can't. Uh, let me turn you down a bit. You're a little loud. Okay. I really want to get the Gaming with Ty um, Twitter handle, but I, I can't. I just take it. So, uh, let me save. I think, I think today has been a good day so far. Actually, do I have anything in my pockets I need to take care of first? Oh. Let me actually do take care of this. Put in storage. Put in storage. Put in storage. Good thing I'll have more room tomorrow. <laughs> I'm almost really full on my storage by the look of it. 92. Yeah, it's getting there. Um, anyway, it looks like I actually might have done all that I can today. So, um... Let's save and quit. Thank you guys for hanging around for the Gaming with Ty stream. It has been a very fun time playing. Um, yeah, it does feel like I should end the stream right about now. So thank you guys for watching if you have been watching and um, I will actually, we will continue on with a raid. Uh, let's see who's on, actually. So, there is, Patty. Hmm. Okay. I totally forgot who this is. But I will I will definitely um hmm. Let me see one second. I will uh yeah, let's um, let's raid Heartless Kitty. I actually, I'm not gonna lie, I totally forgot what, who this is, but I will definitely um, I'll raid them. It looks like they're playing Dead by Daylight. It's a horror game. If you guys do not like horror in any of the sense, like um, like Friday the Thirteenth or any of the creepy stuff, you know, Cabin in the Woods sort of thing. Um, yeah, I'll just you can just, you know. I apologize, practically. So let's uh, end the stream right here, and let's raid Heartless Kitty.